Hello? Can you hear me? Help me. I'm stuck. Hello? Hello? Anyone? Oh, my stars. I'm so happy to see you. I am Alexander, also known as the Iron Fist. And as you can see, I'm stuck here. Please, can you help me out of this? My thanks. A thousand thanks. Just give me a good smack from the rear, with something nice and big. And I'll pop clean out, I'm sure. Don't dally. Uh, there's no need to fret, I'm very well trained. Give it your all, I say. Come on. Give me a good smack from behind, with something nice and big. I'll pop clean out, I'm sure of it. Don't stop now, friend. And just keep clobbering away at the old behind. Put those doubts to rest. I'll be just fine. I'm very well trained. Give it your all, okay? Well played. Though that mighty wallop of yours almost spelt the end of me. <laughs> ah. Well, I'm out now, and that's what counts. I thank you. And as a token of my appreciation, I'd like you to have this. Once again, pleasure is mine. I am the warrior jar known as Alexander. Iron Fist Alexander, in fact. I journey to the east, where I intend to further my education in the ways of war. And beyond these lands lie the scarlet, rot-blighted Kalid Wilds. And upon their southern edge is Redmain Castle, in which a festival of combat is being held. I'd heard whispers of such festivities before. Doesn't the notion set your breast a flutter? <laughs> I'm heading eastward to Redmain Castle on the southern edge of the scarlet, rot blighted Kalid Wilds. I've heard there's to be a festival held there.
The esteemed warrior. Where did you spring from? This was supposed to be a dead end, I'm sure of it. What's going on here? A door from thin air. Well, stranger things happen at sea, or so I'm told. But onward to the Kalid Wilds. Ah, that dead end had me rather stumped. <laughs> It's time I set off to the festival at Redmain Castle on the southern edge of the scarlet rot blighted Kalid Wilds. Doesn't the thought just set your heart aflutter? Champions, prepare for battle! Defeat the general, claim glory, and grab that great rune! A celebration of war! The Radon Festival! Ah, you came. How delightful. Indeed, I thought I might find you here. By the by, do you know for whom this festival is being held? Well, it is none other than General Radan himself. To think, I could face a great champion of the Shattering. A demigod in the flesh. Oh, God. In truth, I quiver at the thought. Such is his frightful repute. But the fear simply assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking. Be sure to get a good vantage, my friend. I, Iron Fist Alexander, do hereby vow to unflinchingly brave this ordeal. it is to see a friendly face. As you can surmise, I've got myself stuck in another hole. Would you mind helping me out again? My thanks in advance. I know you're the man for the job. You know what to do, hmm? Give me a good smack from behind with something nice and big. Don't worry about my wound sustained at the festival. I'm stuck back together good and proper. <laughs> Just give it your all. Stop! Stop! Please! That's my face! Smack me from the other end! The other end! Please! Wait. I have a terrible feeling about this. Would you stop hitting me for a minute? Now, I can feel my lower half is stuck on something. I don't think you can get me out just by hitting me this time. Hmm. Let's think. Perhaps there's a way to slide me out a little more smoothly. Now, what if I could somehow be made slippery or some such? Hmm. Let's think. Perhaps there's a way to slide me out a little more smoothly. I mean, what if I could somehow be made slippery or some such?
Oh, a customer. Let's think. I mean, what if I could sum... <laughs> By the gods, you are a man of vision. This will have me as slippery as a toad. Oh, I have a good feeling about this, my friend. Right. Give me a good smack from behind with something nice and big. My thanks to you and your razor-sharp wits. Oh, now, as a token of my thanks, I'd like you to have this. Oh, dearie me, I'm oilier than a toad. <laughs> yeah, there were countless oil jars back where I'm from, actually. And now I know what it's like to be one of them. <laughs> Yes, indeed. I too have a home. Though it is one to which I have vowed not to return. So, I thought I might look out from atop the cliff. But as I drew closer and closer, pow! Wouldn't you know it? I was perfectly stuck in that blasted hole. I can feel the warriors inside admonishing me for my mawkishness. To walk the path of champions, one cannot cleave to the past. I'm headed to the Fiery Mount in the north. I can strengthen myself there without fear of cracking this vessel. I will forge myself anew in its flames.
Ah, good sir. What business might you have in such a place as this? I hardly think you're here to temper yourself with flame, considering that fleshly form of yours. Your timing, though, is impeccable as ever. I've been making just the thing for you on my journey here. Take it. I'm sure it'll suit you to a T. But, oh, it's hardly more than lukewarm here. I won't be able to temper my body such that it'll never crack again. Perhaps I'll head eastward. There's an old saying I've caught wind of. Above the lofty clouds, the icy giant's peak doth soar. Here lieth the flame of ruin, which ever burning roars.
Ah, I see you finally made it here yourself. The city hanging in the air is slowly crumbling. What an incredible place we find ourselves. But that aside, I can't believe you felled that giant. It was practically a god. I doubt there's another soul out there who could have done the same. Of course, I count myself the great Alexander among many. Which means I've but one thing to ask of you. Would you kindly undertake my ordeal? Come and tell me when you're ready. I've been longing to fight a warrior as accomplished as you. You are ready then, I take it. Then let us begin. I am the great Jar Warrior, Iron Fist Alexander. Let me strike, O oh warriors with him. Let us become one champion together. Thanks. I knew you were the stuff of champions. It was a marvelous battle. I implore you. Take what I bequeath from inside me. All vessels are destined to one day break. But the great Alexander lived as a warrior to his last. <laughs> Have you met Uncle Alexander? He used to live here with us, but then he left to be a champion. I asked to go with him, but he said, the path of champions must be trod alone. So heroic, right? I miss him, though. If you see him, you should ask him to teach you how to fight, cuz. He's big and tough and strong. Uncle Alexander said he won't be back again. My home is of the past, and the past, as they say, is a different country. I suppose that's part of being a warrior, isn't it? So, please don't tell anyone, cuz. But I'm actually a warrior jar as well. One day, I'll be just like Uncle Alexander, and I'll have to leave the village to become a champion. <laughs> 